Howdy y'all, Tata Gaming 2020, coming back at you another episode of Kingdom Hearts. Last episode, we defeated the, uh, crap, I never even got his name. I don't know. Let's see, he isn't, uh, heartless. It was the boss of Wonderland. Where is he at? Trickmaster, we defeated Trickmaster in the Wonderland. And today's episode... We're gonna get a bunch of annoying things from the cat messing with the mic. Of course he does. In today's episode, we're gonna find out what these gummy thingies are. So let's go ahead, walk around and talk to people. Starting with this dude right here. Wait, wait, let's chat. These disappeared from the shop recently. In in these weird noises I keep hearing, man. What you got for sale? Alright. Touching a bunch of elemental stuff. That's pricey. I don't think there's anything there I want though. Let's talk to the Moogle. Big tournament is being held somewhere, couple. No, there's not. No, there's not. Die. This is not one right now. Oh yeah, I think we're looking for Leon. Let's see, Leon, where you at? Last time we saw him, he was over here. All right, now that we're back, there's actually a couple things we could do here. Starting with this, we can actually put out all these candles with blizzard magic. To make this easier on myself, I'm gonna just set it to a quick command. One more. Deep Sorry about that, that was annoying. Defense up. Ooh. Up to you what you want to pop those on, but I'd rather have it on myself. If Donald dies, so what? If I die, it's a big deal. Let's not do that. Speaking of Donald and Goofy, let's go and see if they got any new weapons in stock. Alright, watch for sale. Staff that heightens magic power. Smell suit, okay. Defense shield. We will give Donald the Morning Star. Give Goofy the Stout Shield. Thank you so much. Don't have anything to change on me. Give him the Morning Star. And give you the Stout Shield. That's that. Moving on. Alright, let's finally on. If I remember correctly, he'll be towards the second or third district. When did I get more of these? No, I don't want to use Ripple Drive. You know, we'll, we'll throw this on. Just, just cause. I want to show you what it does anyway. Alright, let's make our way around. One more thing. <laughs> Let's put our buttons back. Put fire back on there. I think this is a new enemy. We might have encountered him during the uh, during the uh, Coliseum. Those are uh, yellow ballads. Oh, yellow opera. Sorry, not ballads. The black ones are, ba are black ballads. Blue rhythms. Sonic Blade. See, so essentially, what Sonic Blade does is it it consumes magic upon first use, and it uh, it allows you to charge 
right at your opponents. This even works on large bodies, regardless of the side that you're hitting them from. Don't bother using your, uh, can't even talk. Don't bother using electric or any elemental spells against those guys, because it's just not, not wise. Alright, let's go ahead on to 3rd District, I believe. I would use my yellow. Get out of here. Ow, he got me. Come here. Hold that. Drop Thunder Shark, nice. Alright, head on into the third district. I do believe there is something we can do here now. New enemy! Air Soldiers! Their name, they are as pretty much how they sound. Soldiers, but from the air. But I do believe they drop something else. Like a, uh, I think they drop spirit gems instead of uh, shards. He's got a lot of waves here. Yep, they do drop gems. That's all. All right, let's check out this vacant house here. Well, it's not lying. It is indeed a vacant house. Um, let's look at our journal real quick. Let's see what uh, trinities we can do. That's right, we got the red one. I forgot about that. Okay, we got the red. Get a whole dance crew. Sonic Blade's pretty cool. There are better alternatives to it, but for now we'll rock it. Ow. I need that. Come here, boy. In my waves. Yeah, I'm down. Currently closed off. Let's see what we can do. Well, now we can go to the first district. What's going on here? Thunder. What'd that do? I do believe that does something, but it doesn't do anything in this area. We still one shot shadows, I see. Okay. Ooh, a blue trinity. We missed this. Eternity. Jump it. No, I can't set. Whatever. Off. Uh, I wonder what we're supposed to do here. Mm. I don't have any freaking. I am not popping an ether. Any elixir on that. BRB. I want to go in the mystical fire door, but I am out of MP. So, what do we do in this situation? We go get more MP. And where does one get more MP? Simple, friend. We go to the accessory shop and stop at the save point. 
But we do not save the game. No. That is for cowards. And what are we? We are not cowards. We are playing this game on crowd. We are not little sissies. And because we left two rooms out, they have respawned. I'm addicted to fighting guys, stop me. You leave Goofy alone. Come here, you. Flying enemies are the bane of my existence in this game. Especially small flying enemies, like the wizard enemies. They only become even increasingly more common as the game progresses. Alright, now let's go into the mystical fire door. I obviously you light it on fire. Going to this place known as the mystical house. You see that rock? He's trying to move out of the way. He thinks he's the boulder, and he can get away with it. No, only one man is the boulder, and it's the boulder. Yellow Trinity can't do nothing with those. We cannot get that chest currently, to my knowledge. But there is a way into this house here. Let's head on in. There's something about this musty place. It reminds me of the secret place back home, where we used to scribble on the walls. Remember? Kyrie? Sora? Well, well. You've arrived sooner than I expected. What? You knew we were coming. Of course. Are you... heartless? He doesn't look like one. Oh my no. My name is Merlin. As you can see, I am a sorcerer. I've spent much of my time traveling. It's good to be home. Your king requested my help. King Mickey? Yes, indeed. Donald, Goofy, who might you be, young man? I'm Sora. Ah, so you have found the key. What did the king ask you to do? Just a moment. Presto! There he goes, he got the magic bag. So this is not a golden ticket. Where you can stub your foot on a tiny little stump. There. Now. <clears throat> you can't ask me to train you in the art of magic. We can search anytime you like. Let me know when you're ready to begin the training. Oh, and one more thing. The fairy godmother. The king asked me to help too. I will assist throughout your journey. I do not know. I do not know how much I can be of help, but do stop by any time. Yes. We're not going to worry about this because all it is, it is literally as it sounds. You don't really get much for doing it. But right here, we have eternity. Trinity jump! Mega Ether, not bad. 
Too bad I don't use ethers very much. Or that might have actually come in handy. Alright, let's talk to you. Marvel disappeared too. That's sad. Alright, moving on. Still looking for Leon. Okay, I'm not even going to bother with this. I'm just going to swim across. For some reason, there's just a weird alcove in Traverse Town that leads into this giant cave-like area. Strange. But it is essentially, uh... Dang, Donald. You have blood. Moving on. We're not fighting him again. As much as I want to, we're not going to. Hey, Yuffie, have you seen uh, Leon? Leon's probably at the underground cavern. He trains there often. You know, the channel in the alleyway is connected to the cavern. Well, I think we got our lead. Let's head that way, then. The easiest way to access the alleyway is going to the hotel. We're just going to ignore these guys. I'm not worried about it. I'll do most of my grinding off camera. Just go into one of these rooms. And just go outside. Apparently we could have just went straight to out here from down there. Could have, should have, but didn't. What are you going to do? Yellow operas are the bane of my existence. Look around. There's a secret cavern around here somewhere. Ow. Yeah. Heal. Heal. This should help. Do I have to be on the ground to do that? There's a chest there. Not to get it. My OCD will be damned. Um. Oh, it's dark. Yeah, that's gonna be on a lot actually, so I'll probably just. Eh. Nah. Might as well toss that on him. I was just curious. If I remember correctly, there is a red trinity over here. There is, but it's kind of sneaky. Hard to notice this. But you heard here, we have a trinity. Trinity! Bash! Secret waterway. Suddenly, we're swimming. And there's Leon. So you found the keyhole. Yep. Keyblade locked it automatically. Good. Every world among the stars is a keyhole, and each one leads to the heart of that world. There must be one in this town as well. What do you mean? It was an Ansem's report. A heartless enter through the keyhole and do something to the world's core. What happens to the world? In the end, it disappears. What? We all knew that. That's why your key is so important. Please lock the keyholes. You're the, only, you're the only one who can. I don't know. Seeing other worlds would probably serve you well. Yeah. We've got to find your friends in King Mickey. Yeah, I guess you're right. Okay. Talk to him again. Hey, Leon. This gummy block is different from the others. You know what it you know what it's for? Hmm. Da, 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 da. Ass said he should know. Wait, Sora, take this with you. This stone holds some serious power. I've been carrying it for luck. I want you to hold on to it. How do you use it? 
da 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 Leon still thinking please lock the keyholes okay you got it white trinity can't do anything with that so over here we have a secret chest containing puppies don't know who this who this dude is who's throwing puppies in chess. Just had a magical elevator that just doesn't exist when you go on this side. We are back over here again, but there is actually something we can do here now. Leon gave us something. That thing that Leon gave us is actually something important. Let's see if Merlin knows what it is. Nothing. Okay. We want to talk to the fairy godmother. I just want to see if, Leon, if uh, Merlin had any flavor text on it. Marlo disappeared too. Well, I guess we can't do anything here. I think. Let me double check that. Uh, I guess we can't do anything with it yet. Okay, whatever. Moving on. I'm sure it's used for something, but I don't know what it is quite yet. Well, okay, I know what it is, but it, well, I don't know what triggers us to be able to use it. Ah! It's the thriller. Get my AOE damage in. Come here, you. Take that, thank you. Just keep. Just to keep the uh, content a little bit more interesting, we're gonna fight every now and then. Alright, that's enough. I don't feel like fighting all day. Chances are that's where I'm actually gonna grind though. Alright, let's go talk to Sid. Like Aerith asked us to. What do you got there? Hey! Well, if it ain't a gummy block. Yep. What's this one for? You're kidding me! You're flying a gummy ship and you don't know nothing about navigation gummies? Bunch of pinheads. Inner space ain't no playground. Who you call pinhead? There's a lot we don't know. So what? We have to use the gummy ship to go to other worlds. We don't have a choice. Whoa, easy. I didn't know. No hard feelings, alright? Well, I guess I could lend y'all a hand then. Thanks. Basically, with navigation gummies, you can go to new places. Yo, you want one on your ship, right? Yep, sure do. I'll install it for you. But well, I got this thing. You gotta deliver first. When do you deliver? Just this book. It's real old. When the guy brought it in, it was practically falling apart. Too beat up to restore it to the way it was. But overall, I did a decent job putting it back together. Anyway, you mind delivering it for me? It's the old house. It's the old house, house of 3rd District. Look for the big fire so Oh, we were just there. What was that? The bell at the gizmo shop's ringing. Go check it out if you want, but deliver that book for me first. When you're done, I'll stop by the third house. Stop by the house in the third district. I'll be there. All right, let's do as he says. But instead of uh, walking all the way to Merlin's house, not that. Pretty sure we can just go there from the gummy ship. Sure can. I do not feel like walking all the way there. So here we are. Talk to Merlin. He wants this old book. Hey, it is for you. Oh, that book. So Sid asked you to bring this. Thank you. You wish to know what kind of book it is? I don't even know myself. In fact, it's not mine. Somehow I found its way into my bag one day. It was such a curious book. I asked Sid to repair it for me. Well, I guess I'll put it here somewhere for now. The book holds a great, holds a great secret. The missing pages will unlock it. 
I'll leave the book over there. Do look at it whenever you like. My best regards to Sid for repairing it for me. Oh, and about that stone of yours. You should ask the fairy godmother about that. Okay, here it is. Okay. You know what this is? Oh, the poor thing. He's turned into a summon gem. A summon gem? Ah, oh, I didn't get to read that. I accidentally misclicked. What world finishes, so do his inhabitants. But this one's had such a strong heart. He became a gem instead of vanishing with his world. Can he regain himself? Yes, but only but only his spirit. Now watch. Bibbidi bobbidi boo. Those are characters in Dragon Ball Z. One magic summon spell Simba. Bunch of summon stuff. Whenever you call, he he will help you. Find any more of these, bring them to me. Don't worry, when their worlds are restored, they will return there. Sora, please say it. Please help save them. Don't worry, I will. We have a new summon. Or our first summon, really. Not even a new one, just our first summon. You best go see Sid before going anywhere else. Yeah, we're gonna save the game. I'm not really that worried about saving over. As long as the videos are made out in time, it's fine. Alright, now we can't leave the world because he won't let us. So now we're now we're gonna head off to where Sid said to meet him at in the uh, the house in the third district. Not this one. There you are. What's going on? Riku! Hey, hey, cut it out. I'm not dreaming this time. Right? I hope not. It took forever to find you. Riku! Wait a second, where's Kairi? Isn't she with you? Well, don't worry. I'm sure she made it off the island too. We're finally free. Hey, she might even be looking for us now. We'll all be together again soon. Don't worry. Just leave everything to me. I know this... Leave it to who? Sora, uh, what did you... I've been looking for you, and Kairi too, with their help. Who are they? <laughs> We've visited so many places and worlds, looking for you. Really? Well, what do you know? I never would have guessed. Oh, and guess what? Sora is the Keyblade Master. Who was his target? What's that mean? So, this is called a Keyblade? Huh? Hey, give it back! Catch. Whoa. Okay, so you're coming with us, right? We've got this awesome rocket. Wait till you see it. No, he can't come. What? Forget us. Oh, come on. He's my friend. I don't care. Oh, he's gone. Riku? Nice going. Oh well. At least he's okay. And who knows? Maybe we'll run into Kyrie soon, too. Well, that was weird. We ran into our best friend. Or our eternal rival, as it were. Alright, let's go talk to Sid in the very in the small house, I guess. Or the abandoned house, whatever. The house. I did what you wanted me to do. You guys ever heard of Maleficent? Nope. 
Here she's in town. Who is she? A witch. Man, she's a witch. Who is she? <laughs> She's the reason this town is full of Heartless. Don't take her lightly. She's been using the Heartless for years. We lost our world thanks to her. One day a swarm of Heartless took over our world. That was nine years ago. I got out of that mess and came here with these guys. That's awful. Our ruler was a wise man named Ansem. He dedicated his life to studying the Heartless. His report should tell us how to get rid of the Heartless. Where is this report? We don't know. It got scattered when our world was destroyed. I'm sure Beleficence got most of the pages. You see, it's just as I told you. While you toiled away trying to find your dear friend, he quite simply replaced you with some new companions. Evidently, now he values them far more than he does you. You're better off without that wretched boy. Now think no more of him and come with me. I'll help you find what you're searching for. So you delivered that book. That navigation is installed and ready to go. If you find another one, bring it to bring it to me. I threw I threw a warp gummy in for the heck of it. Thank you. I could jump from worlds you've been to before. Well, better get back to my my real job. What's my real job? You'll see. See me at the first district. Been thinking about the bell in the second district. That one that rang a bit ago? Yeah, the one that's above the gizmo shop. There's a legend about it, you know. It's all boarded up. No one can get in there. Heck, go check it out. Ring it three times to see if anything happens. Alright, you heard the man. Let's go do that. That is a good ability. I want that. Beat you to it. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay. Hurricane Blast. That's a good ability. I'm probably going to take off Sonic Blade. Put that on. And... Um... Yeah, we'll put on stun impact for us. Right off the bat, it's already showing itself off. Hurricane Blast is really cool. It's a really good aerial finisher. It's, almost, it's always worth the time to have that. Now there is something I've been neglecting to show you guys. Get around the fat guy. Good job, Goofy. All right, let's go. There's something we haven't done in a while. Well, not in a while. We just haven't done period. And that's to go into this house over here. That door is not a door. This one is. Welcome to the Dalmatian house. So you check back here periodically because you'll get gifts of all sorts from this. And it will be important later in the game, especially if you're going for complete journal stuff. Kiragagami. 
fire auger gummy. And that's it. Okay. It didn't sound like much because it really wasn't. But trust me, it does give you a lot of good stuff. You're going to want to check this place out time to time. Charge me. How did you faint, Donald? He was be whatever, you were behind him. Uh, are these green work? No, these are green serenades, I believe. Oh my god, I all I might got these names mixed up. I always I always do that. Good job, Goofy. Good job, team. All right, we're gonna. That's good enough. All right, now we gotta make our way up on top of the Gizmo Shop somehow. Which the easiest way to do that is literally just go, go inside the Gizmo Shop. Which is another place we haven't been to yet. Remember in the beginning of the episode when we uh. When we hit that thingy with the electric spell. That does have plot relevance here. Because that activates the gizmo shop. Because normally these platforms right here in the center would be lowered. Let's see what those heartless are called real quick. Green... Rhapsody? I believe? Let's see... No, nope, Green Requiems. No, I was right. The Rhapsodies are the blue ones. Okay. Red Nocturnes, Blue Rhapsody, Yellow Operas, Green Requiem, and Black Ballet. Got it. I'm gonna get those mixed up a lot. Don't even. This place is one of the best places to grind for XP in the entire game. It is where, pretty much at the end game, where I'll be grinding 90% of my levels. character. Donald. Oh, did please tell me I didn't need that magic. Oh no, that might be bad. Oh, for now, we'll see. Cause there's a bunch of little things we could do in here. Like we could press these buttons and they do a thing. There are a handful of buttons to hit in here. Just second button. There's another button over here. Get up here. Yes, yes. And that did a thing. And now this clock is moving. I believe it's supposed to stop at some point. It does. 654. A postcard, two postcards. Got two postcards for that. Nice. Oh my, we're coming up on time. 
Alright, we'll finish this world real quick. There isn't actually a lot left. Before I do any of that though, let's uh... Oh good, I have meat around me. Cool. I don't remember when I got more item storage, but I'll pop that. Here. And then pop an ether. I don't use... Let's sort this mess out. Got all these little small fries, and as you can see, there's another red trinity. Ow. Any more? No? Okay. Trinity! Bash! And now we can ring the bell. Apparently does a thing. And it did do a thing. He said the ring it three times. We'll see what happens. And suddenly a keyhole has appeared. Nothing happens if you pull it again and again. You just get to hear the nice sound of the bell. Ooh boy, you stink. Alright, just gotta seal this keyhole. But before we do that, we get interrupted by Guard Armor once more. He wants a rematch. And now we can actually see his HP. That was too easy. One now. That's new. See, this is reverse armor. Come here, you. Same strategy as before, just beat him up until he falls down and then just focus on one piece of the armor at a time. Ow. You get over here. The ability to single handedly heal yourself is by far the most busted thing you could do in this entire game. Come here, you. Here, I can't see camera. Work with me here. I want to attack the other arm. Shoot. Thing. Whoa, you gotta watch out for that. That hurts a lot. That could probably oh kill me if I'm not careful. Oh, 
strength up, that's pretty good. In the power of wind. Learned. Spell arrow. Got another Navi Gummy piece. Alrighty guys, with that we're going to wrap this episode up here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like the video if you liked the video. Subscribe if you want. I would tell you to give me 2020. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.